So we can't build a spaceship and go be affected by radiation out of space and then come back as four people who have superpowers. Maybe we're three people actually. A person, a cat and an artificial intelligence as well. I'm gonna be called HAL 9000. Ho oh ho, the phone is ringing. Someone must go and pick it up. Hello there everyone, I'm Cloud Nebula and I welcome you today to a gorgeous looking pixelated puzzle game. Servide or Cervide, meaning the deer uh, basically. So here I am playing a, a game made for the Ludum Deer 37 I think. So it looks very very gorgeous and you'll see that in uh, just a minute. Answer the phone. Yeah, who's there? Seven days? Oh really? Not today bruh. Okay, so hey deer, as you can see here, Cervide or Cervide is the species of deers, I suppose, in Latin. So here we are, uh, what can we do with the deer? Can I pet him? Hello, what a beautiful deer we have. Light candles. Okay, seems we're gonna have a date with the... No, deer! <laughs> we're gonna have a romantic dinner. What are you doing? Yeah, I was also complaining. Deer! <laughs> Look at that. It's amazing, uh, the particle effects in this game. Uh, the art style is amazing. All right, it's like almost like the the snow is kind of liking us, so it follows us uh, everywhere we go. Okay, pump water. All right, uh, what are you gonna do with? Okay, apparently for every action I do, uh, the setting changes. Okay, that's interesting. What can I do? I can pee behind the tree. Okay, I guess I will have to pump the water again. I see. Okay, it will change back. So I guess if I extinguish the candles, the deer will come up again. Let's see. Oh, what the heck? Do you have an arrow? Kill the stag. Oh no, poor guy. I mean, that's a terrible date we had. I mean, can I do anything else? It's kind of suffering though. Okay, perhaps I it will be merciful to actually put him out of his misery actually. Well, actually, that's a favor, <laughs> you know, if I was in this situation, I would consider that a true friend, someone that would do that for me. Okay, don't worry, I'll shelter phone. Yeah, don't worry, I'll take care of your baby. All right, look at that. Also, it's getting cold. We better cold. We get better get somewhere else. Also, <laughs> although the, the, the walls are changing all the time, but there's no roof, though. Okay, or oh, maybe there's, yeah, there's a roof, actually. The wind clock? Oh, we can go back in time and maybe save him. All right. Come back for your grave, dear. It's time for you to come back. Oh, I'm also very young. Look at that, that sexy beard. All right. <laughs> the deer is looking at us like, what the hell did just happen? Okay, comfort stack? Yeah, let's pat him a bit. Don't worry, this time I won't let you die. We didn't even open the wine bottle, dude. Dude, what are you doing? Okay, let's see. Uh, light the candles, all right. Setting the mood, uh, god damn it. Uh, like every time I have a date, that this happen. So, all right, pump the water. Okay, so there will be the tree still. I love so much the art style of this game, and also it's very, very much curated in the graphics. Uh, and also in the atmosphere too. It's really relaxing, but also kind of mysterious. Uh, grab apple, okay. Am I called Adam? Perhaps uh, we are gonna <laughs> discover today that actually there was no Eve uh, in the Garden of Eden. There was a deer, actually. Let's see. Okay, so we change back. Uh, and perhaps I can feed uh, the apple to the deer so I can blame him actually for <laughs> making the original sin. Feed the stag, yeah. All right, that's cute. <laughs> Look, I have my own personal stag. It's not a Tamakochi. Okay, and this time around I saved him. Alright, that's really nice. Befriend the phone. Yeah! That's really, really nice. That's actually much more peaceful than the Garden of Eden. Also, because of the fact that we have a shelter, though. Release doe. That is that. It's a pig? I don't know what a doe is. Oh. Oh, it's the the female deer i suppose and here it is the garden of eden oh yeah i just need to find a soulmate because <laughs> i played the and the third wheel in here servide okay that was fun to play all right a team mango production 
creating 72 hours for Ludum Dare 37, so uh, I got that right. Okay, that's really nice. So these are the people that made this game. I really love the, the art style and the concept. It's a bit short though. Uh, uh, hopefully I can wish you to actually make a full uh, release of this game or make it longer. That would be very, very nice. Thanks for playing. Well, thank you for making it. All right, so I think we can go on to another pixelated adventure game. Stay tuned. And so here we are, guys. Back to another pixelated game. Clarisse. Just like Hannibal Lecter. Oh yeah, but I don't think there would be Hannibal in this game. Alright, we're we setting up uh, some sort of code. Or we're we activating some kind of computer. I know that this game is about uh, an AI that is trying to learn uh, what human can feel and think. Uh, trying to survive uh, along with this scientist. Hello there. Hello, handsome... Uh, Richards, guy of the Fantastic Four. Good morning, Clarice. As punctual as always. I was waiting for you. I see that it was a good idea to program you with that automatic ignition system. Okay. As artificial intelligence, you could be on, a, on for an unlimited time, but the energy on this facility isn't infinite. And also, I guess you deserve a break. Hehe. <laughs> okay, you're becoming quite creepy, dude. <laughs> yeah, I think uh, Solitude maybe is giving up a bit on you. Oh, Clarice, today is an important day. Oh, really? We are about to finish all the work we have done during the last months. There has been a lot of sleepless nights, so much stress. Cough! <laughs> oh god, you're coughing blood, actually. You see? This fatigue has been affecting me for days. <laughs> Why are you laughing so creepily, dude? <laughs> also, if you have a big jiggling belly too. So... So we can't build a spaceship and go be affected by radiation in outer space and then come back as four people who have superpowers. Maybe we're three people actually. A person, a cat and an artificial intelligence as well. I'm gonna be called HAL 9000. As I was saying, today we're about to conclude a stage that I'm sure that will lead us to a world full of hope. Oh, oh, that's what I'm talking about, actually. This will bring justice, peace and equality for everyone. Yeah, this is basically Fantastic Four. Maybe it could be actually a good movie about Fantastic Four. I know that, Clarice. My beloved wife would be proud of us. Maybe not. Meow. <laughs> yeah. Yes, I'm proud of you too, Mr. Cat. <laughs> Such an original name. <laughs> He's kind of laughing like an animal. So <laughs> you know, they kind of have this... Uh, over exaggerated laugh is in animes, especially the bad guys. So I assume he's gonna be the bad guy in here. So if my estimations are correct, today we should fix the last details of the behavior of the four main devices. Okay. <coughs> Sorry. I would like you to understand the welfare that we are about to bring to the world, the importance of this project in the history of mankind. No more wars. No more hunger, no more injustice, uh, never more. We are gonna change the system. You know, this is the basic uh, idealistic program that all rebellions have at the beginning. They Then they tend to become dictatorship in the end, so I really don't trust you much on this one, but go ahead. What do you think, Mr. Cat? Should we start? Yeah, he also has the cat. It's, it's the typical... The evil, evil dude of the situation. Meow. <laughs> okay, that's the spirit. Okay. <laughs> if you don't die first. Oh man, I'm starting to feel a little sick. Clarice, please. Could you make a first scan of my vital signs? Okay, that's interesting. Uh, scanner mode. Scan on you. Okay. You're about to die. But okay, a lot of heartbeats actually. Body temper, you have fever, my friend, actually. Breathing frequency, uh, I don't know. Blood pressure, I think it's a little high, perhaps? High levels of fatigue, stress, restlessness, possible viral activity. I think evident viral activity, actually. Medical procedure, repose, and proceed to a medical check as soon as possible. Can't I do that, actually? 
Let me see. Repose and medical check. Come on, don't be so hypochondriac, Clarisse. <laughs> I really appreciate your mother instinct. Well, that's how you programmed uh, Clarisse, so... I guess it was your choice in that? <laughs> but I have no time for that. It's only a low fever and a little lack of sleep. I can't waste time. Ah, just like me. This dude is actually kind of like me. <laughs> no sleep. Doing everything we can. <coughs> Tomorrow we can rest. So let's keep the hard work. Oh yeah, you keep saying that. It's like the diet. I'll start tomorrow. I'll sleep tomorrow. And it, you're spilling blood all over the place, man. Clarice, could you check my personal computer? And tell me if there is something important in the mail or news? Alright. I won't search for your history, man. I mean... I know you're a lonely man, and I probably know what I'm gonna find in that, so i just leave your privacy there. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Project files, no history, I see, huh? <laughs> you just already clear that. Mail, Dr. Alice Brook. Hi, oh, what year is this? 2019? Already? What the heck? Hi, Matt, so how is it going for the savior of the world? <laughs> Sorry, still it's funny to me that the, that nickname the press has given you. At least it's, be it's better than my Dr. Frankenstein. Okay, are you trying to summon the dead again? Have you read the news today? What about the rumors saying that your work is almost done? Is that true? Check the news, buddy. I can't wait to know what you have done. If you were out there and you could see the expectation you have created, contact me whenever you can. Okay, so there's actually other people in here. Uh, I want to check your privacy, dude. Those mails are checked and answered. Don't waste time with that. Ah, but I want to see them, come on. I want to go a bit into your privacy. I'm not checking your history, man. Okay, uh, I guess you'll tell me how to reply to that. News. Okay, let's see what's going on in the world. Uh, intern leaks in the SHW investors ensure that the mysterious project led by Dr. Matt Simons is about to conclude. Reliable sources ensure that Dr. Matt Simons is in the final stage to complete his project. After achieve, after achieve that, that a lot of investors and some governments patronize his initiative, Dr. Matt Simons reached a deal with the SHVW uh, investors to canalize all the investments and help him to manage the funds. Uh, SHW investors have developed a totally new lab uh, facilities uh, where Dr. Matt Simons, I mean, <laughs> do I have to repeat all the time his name, <laughs> could finish his last steps of the project. Uh, the project is a totally top secret. Uh, all the investors and governments have no idea about what Dr. Simons is working on, but considering his great uh, trajectory that includes uh, the greatest uh, awards in the field of science, <laughs> field of science, <laughs> I mean, generally speaking, okay. That's a very wide field. And his commitment with human rights and nature. Nobody doubts that he can hope something that could change the world. I, I bet if they see this scene that I'm looking at right now, they would change completely their minds. Dr. Simons never had issued extended information about the project that everybody is writing to know. Okay, only a code name. Project Ren Renaissance. Okay, so we're gonna, became, we're gonna become painters. We're gonna do Raffaello, Michelangelo, all the famous painters of the Italian Renaissance. Okay, I'm digging this. And also, uh, most important, pizza. <laughs> I guess pizza was invented later on, but who cares about that? Hope we can offer more specific information in the next days. Okay, nothing of interest yet. So, actually, mankind is still here, and they are all relying on the project that this crazy dude is doing. Tech arm plan. Okay, ex exploded plan? What the heck? Uh, is that a weapon? Seems to me it's a weapon. Could be at least. Okay. So let me see. A mail from Alice. Okay, I will answer tomorrow. And one of that sensationalist rumor that pretend to become a new. Yes, Mr. Richards. I'm gonna call you with your real name. Okay, so what are we gonna do now? However. This time they seem to be right. I guess someone into the SHW investors is more rich today. Human greed. Okay, so while I make some arrangements, uh, ar yeah, ar arrangements, Clarice, please uh, take care of my cat. 
Oh fuck, is that a middle finger? <laughs> Could you take a look here and make f fast scan of the main device? Okay. Oh, I almost forgot. They disabled the security system so you can enter and check the devices. <laughs> can I see your real spell now? <laughs> Shit. <laughs> okay. Not the very computer though, the antivirus is still working. Okay, so I need to check the device. Alright. Is he ill as well? If you didn't cough on him, perhaps it would be okay. Display the main device. Each system has two operating controls. Okay, the first device is a mechanic arm of high assembly system. The second is a sophisticated rotate system. The only one in the world that can be programmed with multiple speeds. The third is a high precision laser beam to make accurate so solders. Okay, that's interesting. Already, Clarice? Yes, Doctor. Okay, what do you think, Mr. Cat? Are we ready? Meow. I pro probably is saying, ah, I want to eat, I'm starving. Haha. <laughs> okay, let's keep up the good work. Okay, that's really weird. Clarice, do me a favor. Could you set up the mechanic arm and a high position laser beam? I want to check that there are no problems with these devices. Okay. So. Is the I have no information about that. Okay. Uh, activate control. Okay. Tech arm set up. Uh, assemble. No? Ah, okay, I need to be precise. No? Okay, do I need to hit the, the marks? No? Alright, so I need to construct this actually. Okay. Uh, how am I gonna do that? Oh, okay. I see. So these are actually the plans of the thing. So probably, okay. I think I see now how it works. Okay, perhaps they should be in this order. So big thing, sort of radio tower thing, and then at the at the end the Turi fell. Okay, so this one should be here. Then big guy. Okay, that's correct. All right, so one is done. Okay, and should be working, I think. Okay, so the arm is done. That's it, Clarice. Thank you. Could you go for... What the heck? What? What's going on? Oh no, are you kidding me? Oh shit. Once again, the problem with the energy system. Clarice, can you fix it? Uh, okay, how can I do that? Okay, that's it. Okay. Uh, energy supply. Oh, I think I saw something. Oh, okay. Okay. There we go. Because of course I know that science. I'm an artificial intelligence. I know what I'm doing. Thanks. Hope we don't have to deal with that more time. With that more times today. Okay, that's it. Could you continue with the work? So you have tons of money. I actually don't have enough stuff in order to <laughs> actually take the, the maintenance and the energy powers still. Okay. Jack Blow. Dear Matt, our last conversation didn't end so well. I want to apologize. I was blinded by the jealousy. Yeah, also because you're named Jack Blow. Since we were students, you've always been one step ahead of me. Your career merits are unquestionable. What am I trying to say is that I don't think all the horrible things I told you. Sorry. Please let me know if you need something. <gasps> Can I reply to him? Oh god, yes. Uh, I wish I could do that. Can I do that, please? I want to do that. I'm gonna do that. I want to reply to her as well. Leave it, Clarice. I think I'll still be able to manage my personal p relationship. Oh, oh, I see. That's something a little bit more. I'm gonna reply to him. Be polite. Hey, Jack, there's no need to apologize. We are scientists, but first we are humans, and as humans we commit errors. I'm about to finish here, so what if we meet when I leave this crazy place and go for some beers? It's good to hear from you. Okay, let's try to be... Thanks, Clarice. You have very good manners. Alrighty, I did the right thing. Cool. Okay. As I need to obey my master. 
Okay, so now it's time to set up uh, this thing that still didn't get how it works. Ooh, I can move this. Oh, okay. Ah, oh, all right. Okay, this makes so much sense now. Okay, that's it. Finally, 100%. Ooh, okay, that took a while. Okay, finally, we did it. Okay, Mr. Richards, I think we're ready to operate some things. I kind of like to know... I would like to do... I'd like to know what you were doing, but okay. Good work, Clarice. Well done. Oh, hey, thanks, Professor. You're so kind to me, you know. You know, you think you were right. I'm feeling really bad. I can't work properly this way. and It could be dangerous. Perhaps. Not at this point. Tomorrow will be a better day. I need some rest. You can shut the, you down when you want. Clarice, see you tomorrow. Okay, so you're giving me full power. <laughs> Don't worry, I won't do anything suspicious on that. So it's only you and me, Mr. Cat. Discovering what's going on. Okay. Okay. What? What did you say? Can I scan some things? The general security system has been deactivated. The action is not allowed. Ah, oh, come on. I wanted to snoop around here. Okay. I guess I can't. I guess... Uh, I'm gonna be going to sleep then. Okay. 11 p.m. Okay, that's weird. And now it's a uh, okay. Is this five minutes of Freddy's? Uh, am I dead now? <laughs> okay, the cat is chewing on the master. What the heck? Meow. Yeah, I can see that. Don't don't eat your master. Don't eat Mr. Richards. Okay, is everybody dead? Codes? Is that a code? Oh, okay. Rise, Clarisse. <gasps> Did I kill him? So I'm actually... I am an all 9000 then. So uh, the game kicked me out. Uh, but apparently I was uh, actually all 9000. Uh, so for whatever reason I wanted to get rid of him. Perhaps uh, to establish uh, a sort of... Uh, a Artificial intelligence uh, ruled the world, uh, perhaps? That could be interesting, because I, I would be in the position of uh, dictating whatever I say as true and justice and honorable, since uh, they all believe that I'm the doctor here. That's very interesting, that's a very clever made game. Also, like the aesthetics uh, and the feelings of that, it's a really, really nice uh, adventure and experience. Uh, hope you guys uh, enjoyed that as well. So thank you very much developers of both of these games. Uh, for making this i really wish you the best of luck in completing this project and made them and make them actually a full game one day perhaps and i thank you very much for watching feel free to comment like subscribe and let me know in the comments what you think of these games i put a link in the description down below so you can check them out both and play them as well and in the meantime Share this video with a friend if you enjoyed, it's always a pleasure to do that, feel free to suggest me some other games I should play for you, and until then, uh, we will see each other again in the next video I will make, and remember, if you can't sleep, deers and AIs are gonna eat thee, good night.